Why you got the X on the top cat, man? Any particular reason? I do think it make it easier for you to find, though. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, because it was original. You know, like if you go look up top cat with the A, all type of shit gonna pop yeah. up, man. You know, all type of weird cartoons and shit. So yeah, I put yeah, the yeah, X yeah. on it yeah. and just copyrighted it like that. You know, that way, like just on Instagram, all you gotta do is type in top cat. I know no that. underscore, no you. nothing, just yeah. straight like that. Even on Google, you know. Yeah, I noticed that because you said Google me and I did that and I was able to find your project six. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. that, that, when did that drop? That dropped last year. Okay. And uh, it's been doing good. You know, I um, work with PR firms, different managing companies okay. to get it out there. You know? oh, okay, that's what's up, man. Because, yeah, it definitely seemed like a little professional look. And, appreciate, uh, appreciate I, I can see, you know what I'm saying? You even connected how you get the mentorship with like, I seen you on your Instagram with Juvie and you got, you know, skilled, which is yeah. some legends out of here, man. How you even be in the same room with them, bro? Well, see, that happened because I have, well, when I was 14, I was with this label called Pools the Child Entertainment, you know. Okay. I did a, um, a studio album under that label mm -hmm. and I had a manager. And my manager introduced me to Juve and okay. Skip and the Chopper City Boy, Snipe Man. and Wack. I know all them because of him, you okay. know. And I'm 26 now, so they basically watched me grow up since then. So, yeah. we, you know, I'm tight with them, you know. Yeah, and then now, uh, and keeping it real, bro, I was actually going to fucking just give you 16 bars and like not interview you but then i listened to the fucking music bro and you had a story in there yeah. like it, it's that's what so compelled me because i was like damn he don't really got enough content maybe it's right. early in the game you know what i'm saying right, right. let me say the interview but then i was hearing your story and that's what made me even you know what i'm saying right uh even fuck with it bro so that's yeah. uh so six is about you being yeah, shot yeah, six right. times well i actually got shot eight times but they went in and out so when i got shot the first time i had four bullet holes yeah when i got shot the second time i had 12. damn so it was it was just hectic, it was hectic. and you said you got shot twice in front of your mom yeah we're like six months apart from each other damn. you know yeah that but, shit crazy yeah this shit was crazy that kind of just seemed like new orleans life bro like just from the outside looking in, cause you know I'm yeah. from Texas, but it's saying like most rappers get shot or killed in Louisiana, not even just New Orleans. Yeah. It's like yeah, yeah, the yeah. most place where, you know, rappers probably get killed more here more than any other place than I've seen in my time. You know what I'm saying? And what, what you gotta say about that culture? Like, what is that? You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's sad, but that's just how it is down here because everybody neighborhood beefing with a different neighborhood somebody yeah. got beef over something is you know what wards? i'm saying it's the wards it's or... the wards yeah so and the checks is the wards and the projects there's two different Separate, things so yeah. everybody beefing about something and once you become a rapper and you putting yourself you like out there so and you yeah. represent for so when you do a show or something you know, your ops might show up and get you that night, you know, just like that. Videos and stuff like Damn. that, dudes going live. They got so many people watching, they don't even know who really watching them, you know. Or yeah. Who telling on them or something or whatever. It's just, it's crazy. It's so small down here that everybody know each other. Yeah, so really. that's pretty much how I go. Because, yeah, I, I noticed, man, even the last, the last time y'all kind of had a wave, the two top dogs, you know, uh, Young Greatness, R.I.P., and mm -hmm. probably BTY Youngin was the last I remember y'all yeah. kind of having somebody like Big since yeah. Wayne. Right. And then, you know, even them. So it's like, damn. So the Slim yeah. too, though. Oh, yeah. So the Slim was he the very first. Of them. Yeah. So 
But a lot of rappers got killed down here, like Yellow Boy, Lil Derek. Yeah, yeah. You know. Even that wasn't be so big. Yeah, but it's just, I don't know. It's All just over a, beef? It's over beef, you know, and other things. Like, they got a lot of killers down here, so that's just what it is. You just gotta. What would make you wanna rap knowing that? Cause just, just from the outside looking in, like I say, like, you already know it. It's, it's, it's news, it's on record. But you still want to go, you know, be the representative for your hood? Like, what what make you still get that drive and that ambition to want to do that? Well, really and truly, I feel like it's just not what you do, it's how you do it. And yeah. I feel like I know how to do it. I'm not going to be out there going to any shows and just participating in every activity, you know. I do things that's beneficial for my career. Yeah. You know, not just anything, you know, just taking chances and risk and trying to hope it work out. Like, exactly, that's not what exactly, I do, you know. Exactly. I'm Calcula looking for for sure things. Yeah, you know, calculated yeah. like a sandwich. I want to know if they got mayonnaise, <laughs> ketchup on there. Yeah, yeah, Don't yeah. put too much, you know. Yeah, exactly. And now, that's just what it is. Yeah, and now you got the, uh, you know, you got your, your, your mixtape out. Uh, your album. What else do we got to look forward to, man? Right now, I'm just working on doing more videos, getting more content. Yeah. I'm working on a DVD project at the same time. More photo shoots. I'm trying to do like two albums mm -hmm. and just put more music out and just basically create faster than they can copy. I'm yeah, just yeah, trying yeah. to keep it going, you know. Yeah, I noticed it's a big scene, man. It's been a big gap for that next star since like a Wayne or something like that. Mm -hmm. uh, what you think the city is missing and like, you know what I'm saying? Even though it's on the rise, what do you think been holding y'all back so I long? I think the hate in the city holds us back. It's just like the bad that just put out bad energy. Yeah. You know, it's just, it's just people just don't want to see you make it. Even the people who you love the most, it's just, they do stuff that you could just feel it like, man, come on. Yeah. And it's like, it's harder for you to try to succeed because the people around you could break you. Man, real talk. You see, so you can't even surround yourself with them kind of people. But what is it? What if it's your everyday people, like your closest people? Exactly. That sneak you, you know? Yeah, it's yeah. crazy, man. Oh, shit. Any uh, shout outs, anything, man? We getting out of here in the Oilers edition. Anything you got to say? Uh, I just want to wanna shout out. out Key, man. That's my shooter. I want to shout out Phil. You know, that's my producer. I mean, not my producer. <laughs> I'm sorry. Right now, I'm so high. I want to yeah. shout out Phil. That's my fucking manager. Now you my producer. And Skip Jewel, man. What's up with it? What's up to the world, man? Fuck with me. I'm Top Cat. Alrighty, man. You heard it here first. New Orleans edition. We got Top Cat in the driver's seat, man. Then I go, that's disrespect. Yeah. I treat her like a hoe, that's disrespect. Yeah. You don't answer calls, collect, that's disrespect. Yeah. You don't send no money, that's disrespect. You don't send no pics, that's disrespect. Yeah. Kill you and fuck your bitch, that's disrespect. Yeah. When a nigga switch, that's disrespect. Uh. When a nigga snitch, that's disrespect. I treat you like a lick, that's disrespect. I kill your whole click, that's disrespect. I kill you for a check, that's disrespect. Kill you in your project, that's disrespect. Kill you in front of your dough, that's disrespect. Kill you and fuck your hoe, that's disrespect. Yeah, yeah, yeah.